Welcome back, this is Tony Fuentes, and today we have a special treat. We're going to do the custom guitar tone patch of guitar legend Cody Harry from Shotgun Messiah. I'm going to give you the settings for the Cody Harry Shotgun Messiah guitar tone of 1991. Made popular in 1991. Uh, Shotgun Messiah is an awesome heavy metal band. Go check them out. They have a lot of great hits like Heartbreak Boulevard, Don't Care About Nothing. I'm just going to be noodling around in the background, but you already heard the demo and I hope you like it. I try to get as close as possible. Obviously, I'm using the Boss Evan JS10, which has the Boss GT100 effects processor already built into it. All right, we're going to go through these settings really fast. All right, so let's go ahead and begin. These settings have already been uh, set, so I'm just going to show you the settings that I have. Go ahead and uh, uh, put them in your... Uh, the more my settings rather will work with your stop boxes, uh, rack mounts, uh, computer based software effects that you would have, Line 6 Helix, Line 6 Pod, any of your fractal audio, 1, 2, 3, whatever you have, I'll get you there. Just look at the screen and I'll get you there, right? Let's go ahead and begin. Uh, we're going to go with the Cody Harry. I call it Cody Harry 91. Call it whatever you like. As a real flash, those are my settings that I have for this tone right now. It's a very crunchy tone, very brittle, high gain tone that Harry Cody loves uh, to use. And this is my closest attempt I can get. But I'm really happy with it and I uh, hope you like it too. All right, let's go ahead and choose the amp. The amp that we're choosing for this tone patch is going to be uh, modeled after a Soldano SLO100. So look for your model amps and you're going to go with a Soldano SLO100. All right. My gain obviously is at 120, excuse my fingers there, and my effect level for this tone is at 48, alright, next. Our bass is set at 28, our middle is at 100, our treble is at 100, and our presence is at 50. You're all Tony, Harry Cody the bitch! Harry Cody does use these settings. <laughs> these are my settings that I try to get close to. I don't know what he's using, I don't think anybody knows, but you know what, play with it. Once you lock this tone in, Play with it. You may want to add more gain, less gain, more reverb, more delay, whatever you want to add to it or tweak it to make it better. By all means, go for it. But bitch, this is my <laughs> This is, We need a little humor for the Corona China virus. We need a little humor for this Corona China virus. So let's go ahead and continue with the um, uh, with the settings, right? So while everyone's cooped up uh, for the Corona uh, virus and we're quarantined, whatever, uh, let's go ahead and learn some guitar tone patches. All right, so we're gonna go with, again, bass at 28, middle at 100, treble at 100, and the presence I have it at 50. Uh, T comp, I have it at zero, it's on. If you don't have this, uh, it just happens to be on my screen. Don't worry about it, it won't affect your tone. Uh, but we do have a compressor, I believe, and there it is. So I'm gonna use a compressor effect on this. There is my sustain at 36, my attack is at 57, my tone is at 30, and my level is at 30, right? If I'm going too fast, uh, don't worry about it. You can always rewind it. Um, I do have an overdrive distortion for this uh, effect to give it more crunch. All right, so let's go ahead in there. I'm using a Boss OD1 overdrive pedal. Uh, so use something similar to that. Any overdrive will work, I, I guess. But those are all my overdrives and distortions. I play with all of them. I like the best with the overdrive OD1 pedal. If you want to try something else, by all means, go for it. All right. Um, again, these tones are for you to have and to tweak and make them better if you can. I, I'm playing also with my uh, Custom Tiger and my pickups are DiMarzio Super Distortion. So what you hear are my DiMarzio Super Distortion pickups. Alright, so in my Overdrive OD1 panel I have 68 on the drive, bottom is at 0, tone is at 0, and the effect level is at 12. All these uh, knobs that you see emulate the actual boss effects. So, just so you know, um, Let's see, as I give you an example of it. Sorry, I left that. Where is it at? I had it right here. Ba -ba -da -da -ba -ba. Where is it? Oh, I'm looking at something here. Oh, let's see. Uh, ba -ba -da -da. Oh, I can't find it now. So never mind about it. Don't worry about it. 
But anyway, so th these are my overdrive distortion pedals. On my OD1 pedal. I'm looking for something. I can find it. But here we go. Yeah, so the OD1 is the Boss OD1 pedal. Alright, so here we go. Next, uh, my uh, noise gate is at 52, so there you go. That's right in the middle. I do have EQ. EQ, I get a lot of uh, crunch on this, alright? So my low gain is at plus 10, my high gain is at plus 20, and my effect level is at plus 2, alright? So go ahead. Now, if you, again, uh, real quick, if you don't have EQ, grab a distortion pedal and crank up the distortion, alright? They'll get you in the vicinity. If you don't have EQ, uh, substitute EQ, the crunch, and just grab a distortion pedal, alright? Uh, low mid frequency, I have it at 3.15. Low mid Q, I have it at 8. And low mid gain, I have it at minus 14. My high mid frequency, 20.0. High mid Q, 0 0.5. And the high mid gain at minus 8. Sounds pretty good, doesn't it? Again, low cut, high cut, I have both at flat. What's next? And we don't have any modulation, so we'll see all those. Turn that off. We don't have nothing. If we have something going on there, I don't hear it. Maybe you do add whatever you like to uh, afterwards. But I'm not, I don't have any modulations. Uh, Tony, you have any delay? I have no delay. See, it's off. I'm in the delay settings. It's off. See the bottom right? I have no delay, so don't use any delay. It's a rhythm tone. This is a really good rhythm crunch tone. Typical, I want to say 80s metal, but this album came out in 91. So Harry, Cody, and Shotgun Messiah were late to the dance. And Grunge took over and they disappeared. That's the way it is. Alright, so no modulations and no delay. Lastly, we're going to give it a reverb. I use a plate. If you have a better reverb, room, hall, spring, whatever you want to use, go for it. I'm using a plate reverb at 2.4. Reverb time, high cut 2.00. And my effect level is at 60. There you have it. That is my custom Cody Harry uh, guitar tone right there. And I just happen to call it that. Call it whatever you like to. If you have any questions, comments, or feedback, please leave them below. Everybody, thank you so much for subscribing to my channel. And uh, again, I'll be cranking up videos, but it's kind of difficult with uh, being quarantined, watching movies, uh, keeping busy. So I had to escape and record some videos, all right? Uh, so stick around. Uh, new subscribers, thank you so much. And uh, again, any comments and requests, leave them below. I have been writing down your requests, so those are coming. But get on me so I don't forget you. But I have some really good requests I need to work on. Alright, so that is my Harry Cody Tone Pass for Shotgun Messiah. I don't think anyone's ever done one before, uh, but hopefully uh, you guys like it. And again, play with it. I'm using the Soldano. Maybe you want to have a better amp. So go ahead and try a Randall, try a Marshall, try a Hughes and Kettner, whatever gives you the most gain. Make some boogie, whatever you want to do, go for it. Lock this in and then go ahead and play with your amps and maybe you'll get more crunchy or whatever. All right, that's it for today. See you folks in the next video. Hope you like the sample tones and the settings and so forth, and I'll see you folks real soon. Bye, everybody, and take care. Well, remember, wash your hands. Wash your hands for at least 20 seconds. All right, we're all in this together. Uh, don't be hoarding all the toilet paper, please. There's no need to hoard toilet paper. And when you go shopping, just buy like you normally do. All right, don't panic because the shelves are empty. You're all telling me, is this a guitar channel or is this, uh, you're working for the U.S. government? No, 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 no. I'm just letting you know. <laughs> be safe out there. Use common sense. Six feet apart. And don't be alarmed about the shopping and the groceries and the empty shelves. All right, there's no shortage of food supply. There's plenty of food. There's plenty of food. All right, so just hang in there and just buy what you need. And think of your uh, neighbors and your elderly and everything we're gonna get through this all right i'll see you folks real soon play some guitar relax spend time with your friends and family uh do skype get on the phone stop texting and hook up with your friends and family via skype and on your telephone all right that is my little social message since we're all social distancing i just gave you a tone pass for harry cody turn it up i got a little peepee here peepee's here with me <laughs> Pippi and I are quarantined. So, <laughs> my guy take her out right now. So, all right, I'll see you boys real soon. And uh, uh, thanks everybody and leave the comments below. All right, bye.